Why, hello everybody, this is Connor Ray from the Bread Mafia here, and today I am doing a solo let's play of the horror game Koliath. God, it's available on Steam now for 15 euro, and it's an indie game that's actually got an overwhelming positive views about it. I'm gonna do a full play solo on this, and I'm gonna see how far I get before I wet myself. 56 years ago, Russia. The no, Northern Ural do, Mountains. A group of nine students of the Ural Polytechnic Institute embarked upon a difficult winter expedition to reach the Ototan Mountain. Their journey seemed to progress according to plan. However, on the seventh day of their trip, the weather conditions worsened. They lost their orientation and were forced to set up a camp on the slope of the mountain called Kolat Siakl. It was their last stop. Three weeks later in Yekaterinburg, when their families received no word of their success, the first rescue expeditions were sent. On February 25th, 1959, an abandoned encampment was found. The tent was torn down and covered with snow, with all the group's belongings left inside. Further examination revealed it was cut from inside out. The surrounding footprints indicated the crew had fled the tent. They were barefooted. This suggests a frantic escape, characteristic of people scared out of their wits. Two sets of prints led to a forested area down the slope. The rescue team found an improvised fireplace and two bodies. They were lying in but their underwear, with cuts and scratches to their limbs, suggesting they had tried to climb the tree in panic. What could terrify them so much? The next three bodies were found scattered a few hundred meters from the first discovery. One of them had suffered a fractured skull, this despite no evidence of a struggle. It took the spring thaw, two months later, to enable the rescue team to find the rest of the victims. The last four skiers were found buried in a thick layer of ice and snow. Their autopsies led to even more bizarre findings. All of the bodies had severe internal injuries caused by an undetermined force, similar to that of a serious car accident. No external damage nor bruises were visible, besides a tongue ripped from one victim's mouth and a strange orange skin color. Much speculation arose from these puzzling events. Such theories included attack from the local tribesmen, from an avalanche or animals. Each theory, however, only served to create more questions. The truth behind this tragic course of events remains unexplained to this day. What really happened? Maybe the answer still waits to be discovered deep under the snow. All right, back to one. So anyway, where was I? Well, this place looks nice. Very snowy and quaint. Can't be that bad. Let's just let's let's continue. Let's let's explore this place. Anyway, I'm one of three members in the Bread Mafia right now. There's myself, Connor Ray, um, and my good pals uh, William Murphy and Connor Burke. But I called dibs on being called Connor, so we're just going to call Connor Burke Burke. Or something stupid like butter. Oh, we we'll call them butters. We'll just call them butters. Love you, Connor. Uh, anyway. Oh, God, this music is so creepy. Oh. Hang on a sec, folks. I can't call it. Sorry about that. It's an indie game, like, and I'm really impressed that indie games are getting better these days now, like, like, with Five Nights at Freddy's being dropped and four on its way soon, and this one is narrated by Sean Bean, so I assume Sean Bean is already dead and the ghost of Sean Bean is gui guiding us on our journey. But, yeah, we're in the middle of a creepy-ass snowstorm, leaving this quaint, desolate, abandoned... Alright, let's just keep moving. So, I'm not good at horror games. 
I want to point that out and put this on the record here. The first video, I, I, I will squeal like a girl. I, I, I'm not good at any horror kind of genre kind of thing. The only thing I can tolerate is like The Walking Dead or zombies. But when it comes to ghosts, no, 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 no. You don't, don't mess with ghosts. Because ghosts will mess with you. And the ominous music has just turned more ominous. Great. See how we're doing here. All right, there's a pass that way. Uh, which way are we going? Let's go this way. Let's see where this leads us. Going on an adventure, right? We're gonna have fun, yeah. Well, you might have fun at my expense, but fun, yeah. No, just me. Oh, great. And I haven't even started, I'm lost in the woods. Alright. I think we found our way. Oh. So. As I see it, we have two options. Scary tunnel. Safety. Scary tunnel. Safety. Okay, let's get this one. Really not enjoying my trip so far. It doesn't look so bad. You're coming to me. No, I'm not. I'm nowhere near you, sir. We have no quarrels whatsoever. I hope to God that this is actually recording. This is like my third time trying to record this. Are we getting along? Oh. This place does not look happy. And we're going into a spoopy on ominous cave. That should be fine. Don't worry, I can see the light here. It's gonna be great. Wait, no, 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 come on! In the end, the only thing I saw was a flash. Uh -huh. An insufferable burning light. Oh. The pain ripping apart my body. Please don't. I felt it tearing out of my soul. After a while, uh -huh. I was nobody. Nothing. Really? The light went out and I vanished into overwhelming darkness. Where am I? I welcomed the end with delight. Am I in the end? Is this the oh, great. Great, I decided it was best to do a 360 and now I lost which way I'm going. I keep going backwards or forwards. God, this is horrifying. going on here? Am I am I broken somehow? Or am I not supposed to? Uh, okay, I'm somehow still in the game and I'm still moving. But, can I just die now? Can I just have the sweet embrace of death? Because I'll be okay with that. And then I can stop playing this god god forsaken game. You know what, I, I'm tempted to just pause this stop right now and just get willing to do it. It's much easier and much happier. Wait. What's that? Oh, great. This is their campsite. Should we explore? Let's explore. Why do you lie, Sean Bean? Why? I do not feel happy here now. How bad could this trip be, they said. Investigate and mysteri mysterious murders, they said. <sighs>
Oh. Sorry for my lack of vocals here at the moment. It's just a fact. This is kind of like my first recording solo and kind of nervous at the moment. Like, I'm naturally Irish, so I curse like a sailor. So I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to keep that on the down low, if you know what I mean. Well, if you let your kids watch this game, though, like, there's something deeply wrong with your parenting. Have you ever tried to hold on to your humanity? Yes. When others convince you of being no more than a subject, an object, which they can bend to their will. When they told you so that you're a monster, being? they deserved punishment. Follow the yellow footprint, shall we? I think it's too late. Oh, survival All right, running deep in the snow. Just your surroundings. No disaster organism. Or, or, organism. Organism. Just for a second. Okay. Organism. <laughs> you can focus on any object. Flashlight. Okay. Let's you. Now, so we're at this foothill here and we're going north, it looks like. Alright, let's go investigate the murder of demented kids. And what is that over there? I want to go see that. Is it a ghost light? I should not. No, I should not be here. Run! Hey, 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 but hey, no, 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 wait, stay away. Wait, you're running. Okay, wait for me. Okay, ghost person, I think you're doing the right thing by running frantically in this opposite direction. But why are you zigzagging? God damn it, I'm so unfit. Come back! Please? Coward! Fine, I'll walk on my own. Don't need no stinking ghost. I set out the moment I heard about the incident. I was in the area, so I reported to the unit myself to be automatically assigned to the case. I arrived at Vishai on February the 19th, a couple of days before the Institute's rescue group. While waiting for them, I started asking around to see if anyone from among the locals knew anything about the incident. One of them said he had a hunting cabin in the search region and knew the area very well. I decided to use him as a guide. When the rescue team had finally arrived, I explained to them what the unit's role was in this mission and that all discoveries or observations should be brought to my attention before anyone else's. We established priorities, checked the equipment and set off right away. It was not until February the 26th we found the tent that I believe belonged to the students. Initial findings show that the people in the tent cut its side wall and for some reason tried to escape from it in panic. The tracks in the snow led to a forest a kilometre and a half away. 
But the trail went cold after 500 meters and we had to carefully search the entire area. This was not a place of any average incident. We had shivers crawling all over our bodies because of the atmosphere surrounding us. I was convinced that something more than just an accident had occurred here. I had the feeling we were dealing with something unnatural. Okay, well spoken man. Can you please tell me your point? Nope. So far, let us have a... begins with this unnamed character. Unnamed, unnamed. Uh, I'm going to name him Benjamin Samuel. Hunter, scholar, and extraordinary gentleman. Now that I've become emotionally attached to this character, I'll be way more upset when he gets killed by whatever is in here. Nevertheless, we should continue on our adventure, but uh, Very nice. They have chosen you. No, you haven't. You are remarkable. Just like me. No, no, I'm not. But you are losing your mind, my friend. Slightly. I'm talking to Sean You're Bean. You're slipping slowly into the abyss, and there is no one to give you a hand. Yep. And at the bottom, I am the only one waiting for you. I'm going to pick up the pace a little bit here. You, you, you would understand my skepticism when you, when you hear the voices of Sean Bean in your head. But I think in this case, we do not want to be with Sean Bean at this moment. Wait, 
Wait, wait, wait. What the fuck? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll leave. I'll leave. I'll leave. I'll leave. I'll leave. Okay. Let's go back up this mountain. Okay, I think this is time where we go home. We call it quits. Evens. Even Stevens. Whatever this is. The runner. I don't know what that achievement is. I think the achievement is by not getting all up in that guy's shit. I don't know if he's behind me or not, but I do not want to look, look behind. I think I'm safe for not knowing. Oh, great. Cave. Mysterious cave of death, mutilation, and I have no idea where I am. Great! Hello? I have no beef with you people! What? Wait, what is this? Sixty one north, thirty two. Sixty one north, thirty two east. That's us where we are. Sixty one north, thirty two east. Okay, that tells us we are here. You heard that, right? That wasn't just me. Now, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna put myself together here. Because, um... Uh, that was a bit... On my shit right now. Okay, I'm leaving! I'm leaving! I'm leaving! I'm leaving! back in you know what no 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 we're not gonna play this game we're gonna go this way I'm gonna play this stupid game like following the main story quest I'm just gonna wander around this mountain until I die of hypothermia or something I'm okay with that And I can stop recording. This was a terrible idea. Why did I play this game? God. 
that means I have to go down the creepy ass ghost guy. Yep, I've been here. I'm calling it quits. Alright. Uh, I'll come back to this later. Hopefully you don't like this video enough to not uh, like, comment and subscribe. But if you do, I will get the nuts up to do more. But I really don't want to, so you don't have to watch this. It's okay. <laughs> I, I respect if it doesn't appeal to you at all. So thank you guys for watching so much. Uh, uh, check out the non videos that we have posted on the descript on the down below and yeah we have nothing uh, but I will see ye later